want to make a million emeralds in Minecraft, and to do that, I'm gonna need to sell items to villagers with my very own store, with the goal of buying the home of my dreams. But before I can do that, let's make some emeralds, shall we? Oh, there she is, my store. It's boarded up, though. I don't have it just yet, but one day soon, you will be mine. Right now, I've got zero emeralds, dog, so let's see if we can make at least a couple of emeralds. Greetings, villager folk. How you doing, boys? Oh my gosh. 15 coal? Do I need 15 million coal? Wheat isn't too bad. Sticks. Okay, that's not bad. Boys, I'll be back. We'll need a way to generate emeralds passively with my store. Mining coal and trading sticks will only get me so far. Dude, I found something perfect, man. A zombie spawner. I think I can... Oh, gosh. I can trade rotten flesh also for emeralds. It might not be the most efficient, but it's the most fun for sure. Ooh. Efficiency three. Eh, might as well take it. Hey. Don't need much of this yet, but now I know it's here if I need to mine for some rotten flesh later. Let's grab a little more of this iron, then we'll head to the surface. Hello, boys. Oh, I'm excited, dude. I'm going on a whole entrepreneurial un entrepreneurial entrepreneurial journey. There we are. Lots of sticks, 35 coal, and almost a stack of iron ingots. I'll call that a pretty good haul. We'll trade some of these sticks. Ooh, emerald obtained. <laughs> hey, check it out. Trading our first emerald got us a shop portal, so let's see what we can buy here, shall we? Ah, uh, yes, our glorious shop. What do we have to... What? I encourage smart financial decisions. <gasps> oh, I have to buy shop access first. Ah, oh, I need a VIP card? That's annoying. I have to have a membership for a shop? Okay, well, I might have just enough to get myself the 10 emeralds I need. I will have to basically give him all of my iron. Oh, gosh. 39 emeralds. Yeah, not bad, dude. Let's buy our VIP card access, and now we can make our first purchase here. A resource multiplier I can purchase. All right, let's get that. Duplicates anything gained from mining blocks or slaying mobs. Oh, snap. That'll be real nice. And next up, we've got small store title. Hey, I can buy my very own store, but I need 50 emeralds first. Okay, so now that I have the resource multiplier, yeah, check it out, dude. If I mine a block, I get two of them. <laughs> Sick, man. Oh, that's so nice, dude. Wait a second. I can use that to my advantage, right? I've got an idea. I don't see a farm here at this village. I'll have to go exploring a little bit, but it'll be worth it. Hello, boys. Oh, yeah, perfect. So, if I grab one of these hay bales, that turns into two. So, that means if I just have one hay bale, I've got infinite hay bales anytime I want it. Yeah, man. I found the duplication glitch already. Uh, excuse me, buddy. How are you? You trade anything? Nope. Get some of these wheat. Oh my gosh, I have five stacks of wheat. And now we've got a heck ton of emeralds. Yes, 52 emeralds. <laughs> oh shoot, I just traded all of them. Oops, I should have kept one hay bale. That's all right, I can always get one later. Let's head back into the shop, which is different than my store. I know that's going to be a little confusing. And now I can buy my small store title. Yeah, dude. Boom, we've got it. Yeah, dude, and there she is, my very own store. We're open for business. Well, except for the the fact we have nothing right now to sell, but it feels good. Our investment paid off. We got a store now. Now it's time to stock the shelves. Let's see what we can buy. Oh, very cool. Looks like I can hire alleys to help me farm items. I can hire a farmer alley for 60 emeralds. I assume they'll help get us wheat or whatever else. Okay, what's our most efficient way? Oh, I have an idea. Just need a little iron. Shouldn't take too long with the resource multiplier. Smelt up those bad boys. And now I can make an iron block that I should be able to just continue to mine, right? And two iron blocks. <laughs> okay, this might be my most efficient way to get emeralds right now, until I hire some alleys, of course. I can't be doing all the work. You know, I gotta outsource some of this so I can retire or something. Let's get this iron. Oh my gosh, I have a stack and a half of iron already. Heck yeah, dude. There we go. Now we're talking 52 already. And just like that, yeah, we've got enough to hire our first employee. <laughs> Feels good, man. Except I'm very hungry. Working so hard, I'm starving myself. There's no time to eat. We've got a farmer alley. Farmers can be given sticks, carrots, and potatoes. Oh, sick. All right. Whoa, check it out. We have a whole farm expansion on the back of our shop here. Looks like our alley's getting to work. Keep harvesting, buddy. I'm actually gonna steal a couple of these. Getting fed off my own supply here. That should be plenty of food for us for our journey. Now, Mr. Alley, can I give you some sticks, my man? There we go. All right, so I'm giving him sticks as payments. Oh, and that's planting them, I guess. Nice. So those plants can be harvested to give us more 
more emeralds later. <gasps> look, look. I have stuff to sell. <laughs> yeah. I have a little bit of wheat here. And I can sell sticks now as well. Yeah, it's working, dude. We have the best product at the best prices, just like Crafty.store does. Ah, no sales yet, but we'll get there. Wait. People like free stuff, right? I have an idea. Come on in, boys. Every customer gets one free piece of uh, premium dirt. It's the best deal anyone's ever had. Yep, dirt for you and premium dirt for you. Is it working? Are they buying stuff? Yeah, check it out, dude. My emeralds are going up. Yeah, they're buying <laughs> the premium dirt. It's working. Uh, although we don't give away premium dirt on Crafty.Store, but we do have signed stuff. So, you know, that's probably better. Yes, dude, look at that. 72 orders already. Uh, kind of short-lived, though. Nobody's buying anything anymore. I guess everybody's had their fill of wheat and sticks. So let's grab some potatoes and carrots, shall we? Oh, just grab some of these taters and we'll grab some of these carrots. My lovely alley farmer, let's give you a potato. We'll give you a carrot. And yeah, there we are. We can now harvest it, dude. Yes, check it out. Our shelves are filling up, man. Carrots, potatoes, tomatoes, and Alfredos. Come on down to Crafty Incorporated for all your carrot and potato needs. Yeah, they're filing right in, man. All right, all right. Our currency's going up. That feels good. We officially have a passive revenue stream, dude. Let's see what next upgrade we can make. Oh, I just noticed there's a villager here. What's up, Jeremy? Shopkeeper. Thanks for your shop, dude. It's working. And one day I'll be able to afford it. Uh, my beach house for only one million emeralds. We'll get there, man. One step at a time. Okay, my next alley upgrade is a J and D extension. I don't know what that means. Sounds like some kind of expansion to our store, I guess. It is quite an investment, but I think that'll help us. All good. We can farm up some iron blocks here. No problem. There we go. Is that going to be enough for us? Ah! Not quite. A few sticks later. Uh, there we go. 500 emeralds. It's time for our first shop expansion. Oh, I'm excited. Let's get it, dude. Oh, jungle farmers. That's what the J stands for. So I can now farm cactus, beetroots, TNT, melon slices, cocoa beans. Yes, dude. I have a whole shop extension, man. I just thought I'd be able to sell more items in my shop. But no, look at this, dude. It's a whole new expansion. I even have a cashier, dude. I don't have to do honor system anymore. I'm looking so official, man. Wait, what the heck is this? It's all boarded up. This might be an expansion of mine. I thought it might have been a competitor or something. Hey, check it out. We got some new villagers, dude. Head on over to our expansion that uh, currently doesn't have anything in it. Oh, hold on. <laughs> be right back, my boys. Don't spend all your money yet, dude. I got some stuff for you. I shall hand you some beetroots. Oh, we didn't like that. Oh, no. Beetroots? I might need to grow up these beetroots here. I guess I can plant them here for now and wait for them to grow. Yeah, don't have any bones for bone meal. I could probably hit a Cave real quick, though. Oops, sorry. I didn't mean to. I apologize. I'll give you a raise, I promise. Hello, Mr. Skeleton. Thank you for your bones. There we go. And just gotta grow these bad boys up. Boom! We've got some beetroots, dude. Yeah, there we are. I'm not selling a whole lot in my expansion yet, but we got beetroots at least. Can also sell cactus and TNT, I guess. I don't know how safe it is to sell TNT in a store, but let's find ourselves a desert, shall we? Hello, glorious prickly little boy. You're just gonna grab one of these. Do you guys happen to have 20 wheat? Eh, that's expensive, dog. Now let's find a... Oh, goodness. Here lies Bunny. You will be remembered. But he died doing what he loves jumping. Okay, <laughs> I don't know what that was. Let's go find ourselves a desert pyramid, shall we? A deserto pyramando. I don't know if we'll eat sugar at any point, but we'll grab some of this. Maybe I can sell some cookies at some point. Cookies are cocoa beans and sugar, right? <laughs> Look at this guy, man. He's hiding from me. I barely spotted this dude, man. Straight up, I'm uncovering like a lost grave. Nobody's seen this in millennia. King Toot used to live here. That's a King Tut's unsuccessful cousin. Uh, Flamebo. I don't need much of this. I guess I'll grab the golden apple. Apple. Ah, some bones is nice. But most importantly, let's grab our TNT. There we go. Give those to you, my good man. And oh my goodness. <laughs> Check it out, guys. I got a TNT plant. Wow. <laughs> so that's where TNTs come from. I'm gonna ask no questions. And I give you some of this. Now I can grow cactus. It's not the most efficient cactus farm. I think that requires like string and stuff, right? I don't know. I'm no expert. Now we're selling beetroots. We're selling TNT. I should name the shop, drop the beat, and make a bomb. Wait, what? <laughs> Wait, no. No. <laughs> I mean, like, a bomb song, you know? Wow, this song is the bomb. <laughs> I didn't mean literally make a bomb. Guys, please don't make explosives, okay? I am not liable for what you do with my products. The next two items I can sell are melon slices and cocoa beans, so I gotta find a nice old jungle. Yeah! 
parkour. Hello, jungly boys. I spy with my little eye something tasty. We got ourselves our cocoa beans. Heck yeah. And now I'm just hunting for some melons. What's that, boys? Why do cows spawn in jungles? I guess you want milk with your cookies, right? Or your melons? Yes, my favorite meal. Milk and melons. I'll call them M&Ms. Wait. All right, we got ourselves some melons here, too. I'll grab a couple more just in case. I think I should be good, though. And let's head back to our shop. It, it is kind of funny. I just give, like, a single item to these alleys. They're like, I got you, dude. I got you. There's our cocoa beans. And there's our melons. Check it out. Everything is full now. Our farms are looking great. And we're making about 10 emeralds a second right now. So that's super efficient. Oh, sorry. Okay, let's not jump on the farm, shall we? Sorry, boys. Our shop's looking much more full now. As one of our first customers. How about a cocoa bean on me, my dude? Or not. All right, that's that's fine. Not a cocoa fan. Watching his weight. I understand. Respect it. <gasps> what is that? A rival store has spawned. Ah, shoot. We're making too much money, man. We got a competitor. Oh, goodness. Jeremy, what have you done? I'm just trying to get a beach house, man. Why do you got to make this hard for me? This shopping complex is only big enough for the one of us. I, you just got here, man. I was here first. I reckon we settle this with a competition. Oh. I like your thinking. Loser gives up everything. Oh, no. I I don't know. I like competitions, but I don't know. Like, I want my store to be successful. I'd kind of feel bad to bankrupt you, though, dude. If you can beat me in cobblestone mine off, I'll get out of your hair forever. If not, I'll bankrupt you. Jeremy, man. Oh, gosh. I stopped making money. Oh, no. <laughs> Oh, no. There's no customers at my store anymore. What have you done? Oh, gosh. All right. Well, I guess I have no choice. My record is 504 minutes. Beat that. All right. I have some ideas for this. You're on, Jeremy. Let's do this, dude. All right. I've got four minutes to mine 500 or more cobblestone. This is not going to be easy, but I do have some tricks up my sleeve. First up, I need a little bit of iron to start with. I've got an iron pickaxe. I don't have time for diamonds, most likely, but check out these big brain moves, man. I've got an anvil now, and now I can put in my efficiency three from earlier. It's not efficiency five, but we'll take it, dude. Gotta move fast. Gotta move fast. Ooh, ooh, gotta move fast. Here's some... Oh, okay, okay. That's not bad. Our bar isn't going up very high, but we can just keep mining. Ah, I don't know if this is gonna be fast enough, dude. Why did I agree to this? I guess I didn't really have much of a choice. Ah, I don't think efficiency three is gonna do it. 504 minutes is so fast, dude. I would need to get, like, a beacon. I can't do that. I can't take out a wither. Efficiency five. I can't do that in four minutes. Uh, I think. Ah, uh, we basically made no progress on our bar here. I can't just do this. Hold on. Let's see what I got in my shop here that might be able to help me. Come on, give me something, dude. Delivery service, I can afford. That doesn't help me. An alley. The cave explorer. Dude, if you mine cobblestone, that's gonna be so nice. All right, it's worth a shot. I don't know if he mines cobblestone, but I can give him items for me to sell, too. Hey, there he is. Look at it, man. Oh, it's working, dude. My stone mind is going up. So our little guy is mine down there. Go, Alley, go! Teamwork makes the dream work. I don't want to stop now, though. I'm going to mine alongside my Alley. Hopefully, I don't lose this challenge. Come on, please, Alley. We got this, dude. We got this. Just keep mining as fast as my little blue arms can swing. Oh, shoot! My pickaxe broke. Oh, no, no. <laughs> hurry, 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 hurry. Crafty's not going down without a fight. My efficiency might have broken, but my determination will never stop. Come on, come on. Just a couple more, and yes, dude, we've done it. Pickaxe, you've done me good, buddy. <laughs> Jeremy, I think I might have beaten you, dude. What do you have to say for yourself? My record. Only one other person has beat my record before. Congrats for now. Yeah. We've done it, dude. Our currency is going back up, and I assume we can be friendly competitors now, huh? I know we said all or nothing. I'm not gonna make you pack up shop, all right? How about we have a friendly truce? I won't take your customers. You don't take mine. Deal? I feel good about that. I do wanna buy my dream home, but I don't wanna take any shortcuts and play it dirty, you know? How you doing down there, little alley? I like your little miner's hat. That's real cute, man. So our cave explorer alley can be given coal, rotten flesh, and iron ingots, and I guess I can sell those in my shop as well. I was gonna go get those items. I think I have them. I've got rotten flesh. Yeah, I already have all the stuff. I've got rotten flesh, coal, and iron ingots. So, Mr. Alley, come here, buddy. There's the iron, there's the coal, and there's the rotten flesh, dude. I don't know who's out here buying rotten flesh, but you can buy it. I don't know. The market speaks, and I listen. I need some kind of catchy jingle, right? Come on down to Crafty Inc. Our store is cool, and it don't stink. I don't know. <laughs> What's up, boys? We got a special deal today. Buy two T 
TNT, get one rotten flesh for free. I don't know who's taking that deal, but put them on a watch list for sure. There's our iron ingots. There's our coal. Our shelves are certainly filling up, man. Ah, I'm happy. This is good. A ton of customers are coming in, dude. Just like a bumblebee, our store is generating some serious buzz. I'm sorry for that. <laughs> Please don't unsubscribe. Let's head back into our shop here and see what's next for us. Oh, dude, this is cool. I can buy a delivery service for 5000 That's kind of a lot, but I think that might help diversify our revenue streams. Oh my goodness, the cave explorer is 30000 That'll take us a little while. <gasps> but I can buy a hostile store title for only 100 Yeah, I'll make that investment. I'll make a little expansion to our store here. And we can buy a multi-role villager. Let's go check it out, shall we? <laughs> hey, there's our delivery truck, man. That is super cool. I'm gonna ride that in just a second. Stay right there, delivery truck. Check it out, dude. We have an entirely new store, man. So this was the store I saw earlier. Looks like I sell rotten flesh. Disgusting. And I sell some bones as well. What's up, cashier dude? How's business, my man? Oh, goodness. I hear spiders and stuff. Do you know what's going on, man? Is this normal? Is this fine? Stay right here. Looks like I got a staircase. Oh, goodness. This is spooky down here. <laughs> okay. What's happening down here? Oh, there's a spotter. That must be my multi-role villager, huh? So that's how I get all my goods here for the store. What the heck? Pillagers? Okay, I guess pillagers come just to watch the action, huh? Well, we get a bunch of loot from this villager down here having a good time, and I guess the pillagers give us money just to watch. Very nice. Very strange. But the good news is business is booming. Come on in, folks. Step right up. We got some great sales today. Customers have been reporting suspicious activity in the store. What? Are you the suspicious one? Uh, nope. I think it might be that guy. <laughs> <laughs> Sir, are you stealing something? Uh, let me check those four million subscribers! I never in four million years thought we'd reach four million subs. Thank you all for subscribing and for watching my crazy videos. To celebrate the milestone, we're doing up to 40% off crafty merch. Freaking fantastic, for real. So, what are you waiting for? Go to crafty.store today. Pockets. Oh, you are! A bunch of emeralds! dude. Oh my goodness. Well, thanks for reporting the suspicious activity. I guess I gotta be careful for thieves. Keep your eyes peeled. I don't want anybody shoplifted around here. We gotta run a tight ship. In the meantime, let's hit the road, shall we? I kinda wanna check out... Ah! Check out my new ride! <laughs> Drive up to villagers to give them food, okay? Meet me. Hello, boys! I got some food for you. There we go. You can munch on that. Oh my gosh! They give me a thousand emeralds. How good is my bread? <laughs> I guess they've never seen a food truck before, but I'm not complaining. Hello, desert friends. I got some new food for you. There you go. Oh my gosh. This is a super efficient way. Why didn't I get this ride earlier, man? We take our business on the road. There you are. There's some food for you. Enjoy. Thanks for the thousand emeralds. Ouch. And some food for you, Mr. Golem. No, do you not eat? Are you on a diet? Oh, you're iron deficient? Well, that's ironic, huh? A delivery for you and a delivery for you. <laughs> Making good progress, man. My goal is 30,000 for our next upgrade. I don't think it should take long. We're not far off now. 26,000, almost there. What's up, cashier friend? How's business going? There's an influencer coming by? Like an Instagram person? Like a YouTuber? They're coming by our store? Oh, heck yeah. That's just the kind of buzz we need, dude. There's not many people checking out our store right now. Oh, I'm hoping this works. Customers are reporting a famous person is giving away money in the store. <laughs> yeah, dude. Dropping emeralds. What is that? <laughs> it's like a villager Mr. Beast just dropping cash. He's not even buying anything. He's just running around in circles. Thanks for coming by, my dude. Oh my gosh, that's hilarious. <gasps> and look at all these customers, man. Yeah, that really worked, dude. And there it is, 30,000 emeralds. It's time for our next upgrade already. Thank you, villager Mr. Beast. You've saved my business. Yes, we can now buy the Cave Explorer Mining Upgrade. Nice, dude. Oh, looks like I can sell amethyst shards and diamonds. I can sell diamonds now, dude? That's gonna be awesome. Whoa check it out. Our mine certainly has had an upgrade here. If our alleys can mine and sell diamonds, that should seriously increase our revenue. I don't have any... Oh, gosh. That ladder did not go down very far. Hey, buddy. <laughs> I love their giant pickaxes on their tiny little body. Let's find some diamonds and amethyst so they can get to work, huh? Ah, uh, yes. Gravel. Ah, uh, it's just not the same. Sand falling is the most satisfying thing in all of Minecraft. <gasps> is it? Oh, yes. A geode, I think. Just need a little amethyst here. Ah, perfect. Perfect, man. That was fast. I thought this would take a while. Perfecto 24 amethyst like it's nothing. Let me
me bring this back. There you go, buddy. There's a diamond. My shiny little diamond. Oh, I was like, why did I get two diamonds? <laughs> I forgot that I have my resource multiplier. And there's a diamond for you. Yes, dude, that's looking good. Now we not only sell rotten flesh and carrots, but we literally sell diamonds. <gasps> dude, and now we get 50 emeralds per second now. So that's really helped us out. <laughs> Does that mean I can go door to door with my delivery driver just to drop off diamonds? Who's out here post mating diamonds? I'm not gonna complain. Business is booming. Hello, boys. We welcome all here. Let's see what else is in the shop here we can buy. Oh, check this out. We can buy a nether extension as well. We can sell a bunch of golden stuff and crossbows. Yeah, look at our shop. We have a whole nether section now. Guys, I don't think we're open yet. I don't know if we sell anything. Uh, do we sell anything? <laughs> okay, no. The shelves are empty, but I can grab some of this gold here. There we are. I can put that right back. It attracts the customers. Is there a piglin around here somewhere? I gotta give him all the gold stuff. He might be downstairs. Ah, there's our piglin boy. What's up, man? He's gonna help us sell gold stuff. I give you an ingot now. Perfect. I can give you a golden nugget. Whoa, check that out. Now he can do gold mining for me. Yeah, dude. There we go. And now we can sell golden swords and golden axes. Yeah. Oh, that's really filling up our shelves now. Nice job, piglin. Keep doing your thing. And pillagers keep throwing money at a piece of glass, I guess. <laughs> that's so funny, dude. Keep it up, dude. I'm proud of you. Here's some gold. A nice Christmas bonus. For 25000 we can buy a flying fire f flyer. Flying f Oh, gosh. This is gonna be hard to say. Flying fire flyer boy. <laughs> flying fire. Oh, gosh. The flying fire fi flyer boy. The flying flyer. The, fi the flying fire flyer boy. Nailed it. Got it the first time. Let's buy you. I assume he's gonna be advertising, right? Yeah, there he is, dude. He's like equivalent of those sign twirlers. Just throwing out flyers to advertise the business. All right. Flying fire flyer boy. Keep tossing out those flyers. Make sure everybody knows about our great deals on gold swords. Ah, this must be one of the flyers he's given out. The stack of flyers. Step one, give to a customer. Step two, uh-huh. Step three, profit. <laughs> okay, sure, why not? Good sir, come on down to our business. We've got great pricing. We're doing a 50% off sale. There we go. I gave him the flyers. <laughs> We're doing a great buy two, get the third full price deal. There you go. There's some flyers. Where are you going? Oh, no. <laughs> he didn't like my marketing. I tried. <laughs> How about buy two, get the third for free? I think that's a pretty solid deal. You got it, flyer, flower to our flyer man. Keep tossing out those flyers. Two hours later. <clears throat> what? Sorry, I fell asleep there. The boss needs his beauty sleep. Is it time for our next upgrade? It is, dude. We've got our end extension. I can sell dirt, sand, pumpkins. Nice. And the next upgrade is our beach house, man. We're almost there. Just one million emeralds. I can do this. Whoa, look at this. Our mall is almost complete. Everything you could possibly need here at Crafty Inc. No, we're not a monopoly. And government, please don't separate us. This place is is awesome. Let's grab some of this dirt. We'll grab some of this sand. And our Enderman, yeah, he's down here. Here you go, Mr. Enderman. Here's some grass for you. Here's some sand for you. Look at this, dude. Look at all our customers. We have so many different types of customers here. That is so awesome. All right, let me grab one of these pumpkins here so we can start selling those as well. There's a cactus and I can also sell Nylium, but I'd have to go to the nether and get like a silk touch pickaxe. So I think our shelves are plenty stocked. I'm not lazy. I'm just energy efficient. It's what I always say. We're almost there, dude. Only like 200,000 emeralds left. And I noticed something over here. There's no customers in here, man. There's no products here. I have an idea, Mr. Jeremy. My whole goal is to buy my dream house. As soon as I hit a million, how about you take my business and you can run all my stores? How about that? And there's a million, buddy. Here's my deeds to the store. Jeremy, I wish you best of luck in your business, buddy. You've got this, dude. It's time to buy my dream home. <laughs> and there it is. Crafty's Beach House. Yeah! Congrats, you bought an expensive house. Wow, that sounded like there was some judgment in that. I worked hard for that, okay? <clears throat> My employees worked very hard for that. When used, teleports you to your new expensive house. Thank you, shopkeeper. You've made my dreams come true. Three two, one. Uh, here I am. Oh my goodness. It's glorious. Right by the beach. Now I can spend my day 
he's retired, sitting on the beach, and enjoying some uh, donuts inside of a coconut, I guess. It's glorious. <laughs> and there's my beautiful home. Oh, I love it. Oh, goodness. Uh, there's no there's no furniture in here. Well, good thing I have a little bit of money left over. Might need to save that for some furniture. Thanks for watching, everybody. I'll spend the rest of my day sitting by the beach and getting very, very sunburned. Ah!